Hello YouTubers, what's up? Whispering Wind here, back again. And today I'm gonna reviewing one of my LA Studio statue. And this time I'm gonna reviewing Angel of Death statue done by LA Studio. Um, actually I wanted to review my exclusive Leonidas, um, but since I haven't got it till today, so I'm gonna skip that and review this first. But I will get that um, Leonidas statue done by them as well in a few days. Uh, once I got it in the hand, I will review it for you. Um, Alright. Um, Angel of that statue. Um, as always, I'm going to give you uh, all the measurement uh, on this piece and the detail, the paint job, etc. Um, but first, uh, for, your, for, for your information, um, I couldn't show you the uh, color box that comes with it because it doesn't come with one. Um, all Arid Studio statue done by them um, didn't come with a color box or art box or whatever you want to call it. Um, because um, all their statue only comes with a styrofoam box and they wrapped it with a brown box, plain brown box, that's all. Um, especially uh, on their uh, older statue, just nothing. No no description about the statue, nothing. Uh, just plain uh, color, uh, brown box. Uh, but nowadays, uh, um, um, the color box comes with the name of the statue. Uh, that's it. Um, nothing else. All right. Um, Actually, um, this uh, Angel of the Statue uh, have, have been reviewed by uh, the owner of the area studio and the creator um, of this piece. Um, uh, you can find it on YouTube, but um, he's reviewing uh, only a little bit of, on this piece and he didn't show you the uh, detail on the Angel of Death itself. And he mentioned lots of uh, how um, hard to um, make this piece um, and into the statue so um, all the detail that he, he mentioned uh, most of the time and most of the part um, were about the uh, how complicated how he done it so um, I'm gonna do a different one uh, because I don't know how they did it. I just know how to review it. And I will do what I do and what I know. Okay, um, the measurement on this piece, um, the head is about 22 inches high from the bottom of the base here. I know you couldn't see it um, because the statue is uh, pretty high and really heavy and quite wide as well but i will show you the base later on i will give you all the detail um so 20 inches i'm sorry 22 inches high from the bottom of the base to the top of his head uh, or, or it head i don't know <laughs> um and the width is about uh, 16 inches wide from this uh, part to this part of the wing um, and the depth of this statue is about 10 inches deep from uh, the front of the base to the rear side of the base um, the detail on this piece is just really really ridiculous guys it's just awesome um, a few days ago a friend of mine uh, visiting my house and look at the statue Wow, that's a really awesome Angel of Death statue. Uh, how do you know it's Angel of Death? Of course, <laughs> he's having this sight, <laughs> and you know, you know not, uh, you notice, right? Um, um, he look at this piece has a lot of detail, and uh, that's uh, what I see uh, this in person as well. Um, and I will show you all about it and. Actually, this piece, um, I don't know um, if I'm right or not, but I saw uh, an artwork that 
uh, called uh, Angel of Death as well. You can you can look it or search it um, uh, on Google. Um, actually, I believe Ray Studios um, replicating that artwork, and I will show you that. Uh, but the difference is um, that artwork, uh, the Angel of Death um, holding a sword, a big damn sword. Well this one um he's holding the side so i think i prefer this uh, because it's really represent angel of death and they uh done uh, differently on the uh armor as well on this piece so uh, not entire entirely the same though but uh, i believe it was based on that artwork um okay i'm continuing this review and I will show you all the um, detail on this piece. So um, I'm gonna start on the base first as usual. All right, folks, here is the base. Um, as you can see here, uh, there are some people stuck in the base. Actually, they are not people. These are souls. Um, these are poor souls that um, I believe um, um, ask for forgiveness for uh, from the angel of death um, but as you know they couldn't do it um, when I'm rotating this piece you can see all the detail on the base guys and on the back of the base as you can see there's Ares Studios um, logo there um, they always did this on their ev uh, their statue every statue they done. Uh, they they crafted their uh, logo on the back of the base, and as you can see, the detail is really really nice in my opinion. Um, the um, uh, lost spirit here, or the poor spirit, or souls here, um, are crafted really nice. Um, and as you can see, uh, they are. Lots of detail going on there. Um, they don't have like eyes or uh, something like that. They're just plain or pupil uh, because they're uh, spirit or souls. Um, so they um, the, uh, they just sculpted like this. Um, as you can see, it, uh, they painted in green, uh, green east or something like that. Um, it's like a pale green and and for your information all these souls um, um, they're not uh, comes with the uh, lighter feature but actually they glow in the dark so uh, if I or you have this in your collection if you turn off your light it will glow in the dark guys and I will show you that because um, no other youtubers that uh, show that uh, feature even the um, uh, our home itself, our home himself didn't show you that, but I will show you the uh, uh, souls here um, are glowing in the dark as well. The uh, face of the angel of death, I will show you that later on. Okay, uh, let's move on to the uh, body of the angel of death here. As you can see, um, he's uh, wearing this um, um, really complicated skirt. <laughs> um, um, I have no idea, um, but actually, actually, this is what you see in the movie or artwork or something like that. Um, this kind of skirt is uh, pretty similar to the artwork that I saw uh, on the internet, and it's really cool. They done it a really nice job on this one. Awesome job, in my opinion and you can see the amount of detail on the armor guys you can see this the belt the chest armor you can see all the detail and the uh, pet shoulder actually uh, it looks like a uh, wings i'm sorry or feathers um, but they are uh, looks like metal but these are not metal i believe uh, this polystone or resin uh, it's not resin, I think a polystone or cold cast. Um, the detail is really, really nice. You can see all the detail in, 
in this part really really cool and the arm armor here and you can see the uh, detail on this part and the claws really really nice and it's kind of shiny especially I'm um, shoot this uh, statue with three of my lights here um, as well on this part you can see all the detail guys the armor itself is really amazing um, sculpt and painted um, and this the side as you can see look at this uh, shape on this uh, weapon really nicely crafted by them in my opinion uh, and look at the wings uh, Ara home said uh, uh, the um, hardest uh, thing uh, to uh, make this were the um, wings um, he said it was uh, they were too big uh, at the first time they uh, make these wings but um, they done it though uh, it's not that big right now and these are heavy guys these wings are heavy and you can see all the feathers here they uh, sculpted them and they painted them in brown um, some of uh, customers wanted them to uh, paint it in red or black but they went with brown you can see all the detail there really awesome and this is the back of the um, angel looks like and this is the face it's glow in the dark guys I will show you that later all right what do you think I think it's an awesome piece great great piece in my opinion all right now I'm gonna show you the glow in the dark thing here all right guys uh, these are the parts that I was talking about uh, about the uh, lost souls that uh, glow in the dark as you can see uh, my room is totally uh, dark right now no lights at all it's pitch black so you can see all the uh, feature that I mentioned before all right guys that's my review on this angel of that piece done by a studio um, overall I would give this piece 9 out of 10 um, I think it's incredible and cool piece the detail is great uh, the paint job is awesome the pose I really love it uh, it really represent angel of death um, and the sculpt was fantastic um, even though it's a incredible piece um, I, w I couldn't give it a 10 out of 10 or a perfect statue because I found uh, some of the souls there in the base didn't craft it or sculpt it um, really well um, okay um, tell me what you think about this piece um, feel free to leave your comment below um, if you have any questions uh, feel free to leave it uh, I will answer it ASAP and before I end this video I will leave you um, with 360 so you can see uh, the statue from every angle okay thank you for watching you have a good one and take care guys bye bye